Alrighty guys, here is um, King Rabbit Tree, and I'm gonna tell you today. I'm gonna actually I'm gonna kind of do a video that JRS kicked it a while. Why I do rabbits and kind of intro to my rabbit tree. I'll do kind of both. Try to fit that in five minute slot. My battery's run low, and I'm located in PA. My name is Kyle, and I'm a young man just starting to get into rabbits. About a year ago, I did. I purchased some and during Easter from a guy, a man night guy, it was only like 10 bucks for one. And I have two males right now and one female. And I have five little baby bunnies that I weaned Tuesday. Went, yeah, Tuesday. And I'm going to show you why rabbits. And I'm going to tell you first why I do rabbits. Well, first why I do rabbits is it's a fun hobby. I love to do it. And it's you can make some money off of them. It takes a little bit to get started. Like these both, this force four cage hutch was a hundred bucks and that one was fifty that, one, that little one right there but it's worth it I mean it's a fun hobby you can ask Jarrah's kick if you want to he'll tell you more why he does rabbits because he has a lot of rabbits but I I'm gonna expand a little bit if, I, if, if the market's pretty good and yeah that's why I do rabbits and it's just fun I mean it, they brighten up your day um, they just brighten up your day when you see them and yeah and baby bunnies are so cute I'll have to show them to you later I will but yeah they're so cute okay so that's why I do rabbits and here is the intro to my rabbit tree I'll show you my first male here's up here's little Julian that's him right there he's about a year and a half old I purchased him from a guy on Craigslist for 20 bucks that's Julian I'll show you marshmallow as I go here blind you Here's Marshmallow. She is so cute. I mean, she is a nice color. I like her little markings. She's about four months old. I got her for a friend for free. And that's her. She's a female. She should be two months. She'll be a breeder boy. She'll be an excellent breeder. And that's her. And when I feed them, I do feed them a little bit of grass and hay, as you can see. If you can see there, I'll show it to you. But, um, and I feed them pellets, you see. The feeder, it. My, all my rabbits, my males, I try to do what JR's kick does to feed them a little bit. So you want want them kind of you want almost out food out of out of food when you feed them, cause it, then they won't just they won't do the job if you don't. So yeah, that's what I try to feed most of the time, and some veggies once in a while. So that's them too. I'll show you the, his grass here. See, that's him. That's her. And all my rabbits, I don't have pedigreed rabbits, and these are all lionhead rabbits that I'm showing to you. I don't have pedigreed rabbits. I would like to. I would like to maybe get meat rabbits sometime, but I don't have the money right now to do it. Because I bought that water bottle for him for six bucks at uh, Goods Near um, that I got yesterday and PA uh, store in PA. And yeah, I purchased that and a little knife I got for nine bucks. It was pretty nice. So that's Elvis. He's a lion. He's about. I got him for ten dollars from a man like guy. He's a real, real nice rabbit. I like him. And that's Elvis. So that's Elvis. And this um, weirdest thing happened. About maybe January, February. Um, I had a little, a nice double mane from him for that I bred him to. And she just died. I don't know what the deal was. It, it was weird. She just died, and it was just weird. I, I don't know what happened. And then two weeks ago, another one died. So that we had to wean, all, bottle feed all these babies. But they're all good now. So that costs a little bit because KMR stuff's like nine bucks. You get a Petco, PetSmart, that up. We had like three or four, so you can get do the math there. Yeah, that was really fast. And what we do, we might take these. You're wondering why? Why do I have styrofoam on this cage? They don't need star from the spring. Well, guys, a good idea me and my dad did. Like I said, I'm a young man. We put, uh, what do you call it? Uh, something glass. I forget. You have to tell me. Um, and we made, we put star foam right here on the edges, all sides, so they could stay nice and warm in the winter. That was our setup for the winter. And then we made a little where they go to the bathroom for these ones up here I made a little stuff and I'll show you the back side 
so yeah that's why we have this up we're gonna have to take this down soon because it's gonna get too hot for these rabbits don't be saying oh it's too hot in the spring well it's not right now so I mean it wasn't when it was winter so that's why I have that there here are these five old baby bunnies I wean Tuesday they're just all eaten I'll show you one quick they're about uh, almost five weeks old the nice little rabbits I'll show you yeah, they're nice little bunnies. I like them. They're getting big, eating pellets, drinking water. And this is this little cage. I purchased this one from um, a lady on Craigslist for 50 bucks. Wasn't too bad of a price. And here's, I'll show you the back. They're bedding. Nothing special, just their bedding in the back. Probably a little dark here. But that's their bedding and stuff. That's where they lie and sleep in. This is the back side, like I showed you, the thing we made. I think it was a pretty good idea for him there, Julian, again. That's a pretty good, uh, we did. So, yeah. So, guys, uh, that's about it. Um, yeah, that's why I do rabbits, because it's fun and it's easy. Some will die on you. I recognize. Don't be depressed about it like I was. Don't be mad about it. It's just something to do with rabbits. And Every animal dies. You can't print that from my I couldn't do anything wrong it was disease or something in the cage but then I I'm gonna Clorox all these and if you live near PA email me and if you have a line head any line heads that are reasonably I wouldn't want to pay any more than 30 hey contact me on YouTube and I'd be happy to come down and see where you're at and look at your rabbits and hey if you live near PA I'm not gonna tell you guys where I live now because there's people out there that I don't trust but um, just contact me, say where you're at, I'll tell you where I'm at. And if you're a trusting person, I'll tell you my address. You have to call me because I don't want to give my address on YouTube. But um, you're going to have to contact me, email me. It's kingrabbitry at gmail.com. You'll see it on YouTube pretty easily. You can contact me or just contact me on the comments section. And, yeah, so those are my rabbits and why I do rabbits. And hope you enjoyed. And I'll try to make some videos in the future for you guys. And yeah, so thanks for watching, and I hope you liked it. Alright, King Rabbitry out. Thanks guys. Bye-bye. See ya. Have a good day. Bye.